a short list of survival skills. I watch videos of the Avatar Blue People theme park while I wash my hair. Cut the psalms out of the Sunday missalettes and teach myself brush lettering. Fudge up that momofuku milk bar cake like I know what I'm doing. And every time I think I'd rather just go, I write the word love down on paper so I can see it. Even if in that moment I don't remember what it means. See, I've done this so many times I've had to get creative with it. I write postcards to my future selves and tell them, hey, when you're in the big leagues, remember me. Each time I feel it pulling down my elbows and knees. I take singing lessons and let myself totally murder memory from cats. You know it, that trembly sick weight, the bottle stopper in your lungs. You know, unless I guess you don't. In which case, lucky you haven't been living so long that now you have to think of new ways not to die. On Halloween, I dress up as a scammer, but honestly, isn't that what I am? Batting my eyelashes at myself, so I'll fork over just one more day. See, you have to flirt like you mean it. You have to tell yourself you want it so bad. To string origami cranes to hang in the space your door makes when it opens. It's all cheap tricks that just look like passing the time, which is what I could say if you ask. But I decided I've come too far to keep pretending that it's easy. And maybe one day I'll run out of schemes, but that's not today, hell no. My proof is I have a sheet of paper with the word love all over it, all over. And yes, this sickness has no face, but watch me spit in its eye. <laughs>